Are you looking to invest in Africa's manufacturing industry? In this video, we'll be exploring the top 10 manufacturing opportunities in Africa that are ripe for investment. Whether you are an entrepreneur, investor, or simply interested in the African market, this video is a must watch. Join us as we explore the exciting world of African manufacturing and discover the top opportunities for investment. Africa is a continent of immense potential with a world of natural resources and a growing market. Manufacturing is one of the key sectors that can drive economic growth and create sustainable jobs. We've compiled a list of the top 10 manufacturing opportunities that offer huge potential to investors and entrepreneurs. So let's dive in. Number 10, automotive manufacturing. The automobile market in Africa is expanding quickly. It is presently valued at about $30.44 billion and is anticipated to increase by at least 40% to $42 billion by 2027. Several car manufacturing facilities are currently found in countries like Egypt, Morocco, South Africa, and Nigeria. If you exclude commercial vehicles and motorbikes, which are in much greater demand, the average annual demand for cars on the continent is about 2.4 million cars every year but only roughly 7% of the total output is produced in Africa. According to experts, the 1.3 billion people who will be connected to the new African continental free trade area is a market like never before for African manufacturers. There has never been a time like now to fully make use of Africa's enormous natural resources, including copper, bauxite, platinum, lithium, and cobalt, which are all necessary for the production of cars. A good example is a Nigerian automaker, Innocent Vehicle Manufacturing, which has recently gained notoriety on the continent. There's also Kira Motors, a company in Uganda, and Wali Automobile in Tunisia, just a few successful stories. Number nine, textile manufacturing. Africa is seeing an increase in textile production with Tunisia, Morocco and Ethiopia leading the way. Though it's sad that Africa still imports 75% of its textile and exports 90% of its cotton production, Africa has the workforce and resources to compete on this market, especially when it comes to serving the local population. At the moment, Asian countries are the main exporters of textiles to Africa. But in an effort to compete with growing wages in Asia, and few shop supply shortages brought by the pandemic. International companies like H&M have recently opened textile mills in Ethiopia and other African countries. The top three exporters of clothing on the continent are Kenya, Lesotho, and Mauritius. These countries need to be at the top of your list if you want to get into the textile market in Africa. Eight, processed food manufacturing. The food processing market in Africa is developing rapidly and many new businesses are entering the market. These businesses manufacture premium food items for both domestic and foreign consumption. Most small and medium-sized businesses that process food in Africa struggle to keep up with the high demand. It's large corporations like Nestle that import majority of the food, but they have recently come under intense scrutiny over quality issues. The market for food processing currently has a huge gap that needs to be filled. This is mostly due to the population growth and urbanization on the continent. You can easily make real money if you can position yourself to benefit from this gap. 7. Electronics Manufacturing The importance of electronic manufacturing on the continent is rising. It is anticipated that this industry will generate $14 billion in revenue this year and up to about $24 billion by 2027. The consumer electronics industry is booming in Africa, especially in East Africa, where there is a huge demand for products like refrigerators and televisions. The appeal of this market is that most African countries can simply build electrical appliances on site. Be it speakers, microwaves, washing machines, cameras, laptops, and most importantly cell phones, they are all in high demand on the continent. Egypt and South Africa are presently the only two African countries with integrated television manufacturing plants. Though the continent is home to two of the largest electronics manufacturers in the world, Samsung and LG, 
no one is producing consumer electronics that is accessible to the general population, especially at entry-level prices. 6. Mining Equipment Manufacturing Africa's economy has traditionally been heavily dependent on mining because the continent is home to many valuable minerals. Everything from gold, diamonds, cobalt and copper comes from Africa. However, foreign firms have traditionally held a monopoly in Africa's mining equipment manufacturing sector. As a result, there has been little indigenous innovation and a heavy reliance on foreign machinery. Local mining equipment producers have recently stepped up, offering high-quality economic solutions adapted to the particular needs of African mining industry. For example, some businesses are concentrating on developing energy-efficient machinery that lowers fuel usage and greenhouse gas emissions. Others are creating cutting-edge automation solutions to boost mining operations and productivity as well as safety. Manufacturing of mining equipment in Africa appears to have a bright future. New local producers are joining the market as the need for locally made, cost-effective and environmentally friendly mining equipment keeps rising, but there isn't enough of them at the moment. 5. Paper Product Manufacturing Toilet paper, packaging supplies and other paper goods are in high demand on the continent as well. Starting a company that manufactures paper goods will allow you to serve both domestic and foreign markets. And to stand out from your competition, consider eco-friendly alternatives like recycled paper. In Africa, the market for paper goods is growing rapidly, mostly as a result of the growing understanding that there is a need to reduce the carbon footprint of conventional packaging materials and to reduce garbage production. Additionally, there is a rise in e-commerce and meal delivery, which drives increased demand for cartons, paper bags, paper plates, cups, and many things in between. This is a gap that you can easily fill with a startup company at any time. 4. Solar Panel Manufacturing Africa is becoming a major player in the solar business as demand for alternative energy sources rises. Africa is blessed with an abundance of sunlight making it the perfect place to produce solar energy. With more than 600 million people worldwide without access to electricity, solar energy offers a viable and affordable solution to this urgent problem. Solar panel installations have increased dramatically in recent years all throughout the continent, from small solar farms to household rooftops. Africa is steadily developing into a major solar panel manufacturing region. Modern manufacturing facilities in places like South Africa, Nigeria, and Kenya are setting the bar high. In addition to producing high-quality solar panels for domestic use, these companies also export them to other African countries. Local solar panel production in Africa encourages technology transfer and innovation since local businesses engage with foreign enterprises. The production of solar panels in Africa appears to have a promising future. Africa has the potential to play a significant role globally as the demand of sustainable energy continues to rise. 3. Furniture Manufacturing Another money printing industry in Africa is furniture manufacturing. The demand for high quality furniture is increasing as the middle class expands and cities become more urbanized. You can choose to specialize in creating household or office furniture or even try your hand on creating customized furniture. In order to start a furniture business in Africa, you should know the needs and demands of the customers being targeted. Some buyers are more concerned about beauty, quality and durability of the furniture and will pay high prices to get a furniture that meets these requirements. While other buyers are highly influenced by cost, and their choices are restricted to the price of the furniture. They would love to have a beautiful high quality piece, but will only want ones that fit their budget. So if you are venturing into the furniture market, you have two options. Either you go for high end premium furniture or for low budget furniture that is accessible to the general public. You can't go wrong with high either choice. There is a great market for both. 2. Construction Equipment Manufacturing 
Africa is fast urbanizing and developing its infrastructure, which has raised demand for building materials. The demand for dependable and effective construction equipment has never been higher. With many large-scale projects like roads, bridges, and housing developments currently under construction on the continent, manufacturers can save transportation costs, slash lead times, and better serve the unique requirements of the African market by building equipment on the continent. Several businesses have established manufacturing plants in Africa after realizing the potential of the market. For example, the British company JCB the American construction equipment giant Caterpillar and the Chinese company Sunny all have factories in Africa. There are opportunities for business owners to start operations that provide manufacturers with raw materials, components and replacement parts. Additionally, local construction equipment assembly and distribution can be a successful business because it lower costs and meets up the unique needs of the African market. 1. Pharmaceutical Products Manufacturing Manufacturing of pharmaceuticals and medical devices is still in its infancy in Africa, but it is expanding quickly. Leading the way are countries like South Africa, Kenya and Nigeria, where local manufacturers are creating a variety of medical products, from surgical tools to diagnostic equipment. The necessity for reasonably priced, locally made medical gadgets, as well as the rising demand for high quality healthcare services, are driving this growth. Local manufacturers may, for instance, concentrate on creating high quality, reasonable priced devices that are specially suited to the demands of the African healthcare system. This covers equipment that can function in low resource environments is simple to maintain and can tolerate adverse environmental conditions. African manufacturers of medical devices have already had some success. For example, a South African company has created a cheap portable ultrasound device that can be used in remote locations with little access to medical facilities. Another example is the smart solar-powered cold storage system developed by a Nigerian startup that preserves vaccines and other temperature-sensitive pharmaceuticals. These success stories show that African manufacturing is still growing and still has room for improvement and expansion. From solar panels to food processing, these industries offer immense potential for growth and profitability. With the right investment, technology and expertise, Africa can become a leading manufacturing hub, creating jobs and driving economic growth so if you are an entrepreneur or investor looking for exciting opportunities in Africa, then these are the sectors to watch. For more updates on Africa's dynamic business landscape, watch this video right here. Don't forget to like, subscribe and comment for more videos like this.